Hello everyone, good evening, I hope you're all doing well this evening, I hope you're ready to play some comfy cat games with the comfy cat herself, Comfy Chan, <laughs> and uh, I'm happy to see you here, I had a pretty cozy day, I spent most of my day uh, doing chores, um, hanging out with my kitty, He's actually over there behind me. And um, what else did I do? I edited a video. Oh. How are we doing now? How are we doing now? As I was saying, you can check that off your audio problem bingo card, even though it's a free space. But yeah, like I said, um, I spent a lot of the day like doing chores and um, hanging out with my cat. And I actually made Rice Krispies last night. So I'm excited to play some Comfy Calico and talk with you guys. I do have a very important announcement that I'm going to uh, be giving out tonight. And I hope you'll stick around to hear it. If not, I will definitely clip it so that you guys can uh, see it in your own time. And I will post that video very shortly. So hello, goodness me. Thank you. Thank you so much. Yeah, the new loading screen sure is cute, isn't it? I love it a lot. Hi, why me can why? Thank you for the, thank you for the compliment. Hello, another bird Toby an account. How are you doing, friend? Hi, Midas. How are you doing, friend? I'm glad to see you here. Hi, Snow. How are you doing? <laughs> How are you doing, friend? Happy to see you here. Hi, Eternal Death. Thank you so much for letting me know that you're lurking. All right, guys, well, let's get right into it. I do wish to play this game. Don't 
really remember what we were doing last. We're probably in the kitchen. We were probably cooking something in the kitchen. Let's be real. Ah! I was right. I was right. I'm doing fine, friend. Wish you luck on the stream. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Snow. All right, let's take a look. <laughs> right, I forgot how strange the camera is in this game. Okay, so my current quests. Owl by herself, talk to Maya, and spooky scary furniture. Put a piece of spooky furniture in the cafe. Doesn't really match my cafe aesthetic that I got going on. It's very cute and a lot of pink and yellow as we have around here. But I guess we better go do that. And I wonder if I have any spooky scary furniture already. That's not what I want. Select furniture. Nope. Okay. I guess I don't have any furniture. All right. Let's go take a look. Oh, I do! I have a spooky table! It kind of matches. I'll, p I'll put it in this corner because, honestly... It's not really that cute, so it can be a corner table for them spooky people who want to be alone and scary in the corner. <laughs> ah, Alright, now I have to go talk to Ash. Let's go talk to them. Cuffy, have you ever looked up a smiling tutorial? Be honest. A smiling tutorial? No, I, I smile a lot, but I don't really like my natural smile, so... I guess I... Maybe I've, like, taught myself. Oh, I was supposed to talk to her. Hey, Comfy, how are the cats? They're doing well. Look, I did the thing. Hi, you got the heat lamp? That's amazing news, you're just in time. This one died on me again. They haven't started hatching yet. I'll turn the new one on and it should only take a minute to warm them up. Soon I'll be able to welcome these little ones to the world. They still need to stay under the heat lamp for a while even once they're born. Big table, let's go. Thank you so much. You're welcome. But no, as far as smiling tutorial, no. I taught myself how to smile in a, I guess, not so wide. My wide smile looks a little silly. You want to be in the, you are welcome to sit in the spooky corner, friend. All yours. Be my guest. Okay, Ash, hello. So, I did the thing. Hey, I saw the spooky furniture that you added to the cafe. It's awesome. You really got what I was talking about, huh? Didn't that totally change up the vibe? No, because we put it in the corner. Here, you should take this stuff for the cafe too. Estelle probably won't notice it's missing, probably. Huh. So we just be stealing. Oh my kitty. Rusty. I forgot about the big raccoon. Haha, <laughs> yeah. So cute. Okay, I guess we gotta look for some more quests, huh? That's not a quest. Once again, comfy forgetting how to uh, do this. Okay. Flower furniture. Pick a dance move. Oh! Ah. Uh. <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Vanda. Talk to Kiva. Okay. Talk to Estelle. Okay. Well, I know where the little dancing guy is, so... We're gonna, we're gonna go do that. That's down here, so we're gonna go do that. That'll be fine with me. Okay, 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 okay. 
How do I go back? How do I go back? There we go. When in doubt, press escape and hope that the game doesn't close. The cafe is good vibes only. You are correct. I need a big animal. I need a big animal to ride. You, Rusty, you will be my steed. How do I bring up my spells again? Potions. I want to use that one. Can I use it? What is going on? There we go. Yay! Woo! Let's go! Uh, there is a relatively angry cat behind me right now. He really wants to go outside, but I'm not going to let him right now. Such a valiant steed. I had to when I realized that when I thought I was smiling, I just made a half smirk. Like a DreamWorks character. <laughs> you're, doing the, you're doing the DreamWorks character smirk. Oh my god! He's ripping the furniture. Hold on. Hold on, guys. Sorry. Come here. Okay. Sorry, guys. Kitty really wanted to be let out. Okay, there was a dancing little guy around here that I needed to uh, talk to. It's this one right here, isn't it? Hello, friend. Sorry, Rusty. I do Malcolm things in a Malcolm way. I want to talk to you, Malcolm. How'd the dance competition go? It was amazing. Can't thank you enough. I'm really close to him. I'm like really close to him. Help me pick out my dance moves. You really boosted my confidence. And guess what else? I got second place. Well, congrats. Yeah, I didn't think I'd be able to place at all against dancing cats. I feel like I could really follow my dreams now. Thanks again. Guys, look how cute Rusty is. <laughs> He's so cute. She's just standing there menacingly. Here, you should take this. It'll put a little pep in your step. Whoa! Disco ball. Awesome. Okay. Great. I can pick up Rusty. Oh my goodness, Rusty. Rusty is massive. I'm so... <laughs> Look at the way he's going around. <laughs> I'm sorry, Rusty. Okay, buddy. Let's go find another quest. I feel like I need a bigger room for the cafe. Whoa! Oh my god! They're busting it down! Look at that! Whoa! Let's go! Hi, Hato Pelagic Rainbow. Currently, thunderstorms outside, lurking until I get back home. Well, thanks for letting me know, friend. Be safe out there in the rain, okay? Look at these cats. Look at these cool cats. Can I talk to any of you? No? Oh my god, look at that one just doing the little sidestep. This guy's doing the, what, the running man? That guy's just raising the roof. That's what I'm talking about. That's great. Oh my god, he's widowy hitting the gwitty. He's widowy hitting the gwitty and he's a kitty cat. The kitty gwitty. Also, I would absolutely be a black cat. I'm so unlucky. <laughs> I don't think black cats are unlucky. That's right, I asked you guys, who would you be if you were a cat? A lot of people seem to have different opinions. I think I would be... Huh. I think I would be like a 
like a Persian cat or a Himalayan cat? Hey, wait a second, you're new. I'm Lee, we should be friends. We're friends now. And you cleared the way to Heart Village? Maribel's fashion store is the best. We should hang out there sometime. Bro just gave me the lamest design of all time. And Valen told me to be his friend. Do you have a quest to give me? Catman? Need anything? I need help with something, okay. Oh, it's embarrassing. I would literally be Garfield. <laughs> I love Garfield. There's this, um, this like 1980s commercial for a Garfield Valentine's bouquet. And I was like, damn, I wish I could travel back in time to get the 1985 Garfield Sweetheart Roses Valentine's bouquet. Bunny rabbit plushie that got added to the claw machine. I thought I'd be able to get it for her, but nut machine is totally impossible. Use up literally all my change trying and trying. I'm so close. Hello, my grass are almost there. I thought he was gonna ask. I thought this man was gonna ask me to go get it out of the claw machine, and I was so excited. I was like, whoa, a claw machine game, but no, he just wants my money. You bomb. Oh my god. Top 10 brokest individuals of all time. Ain't no way. Ain't no way. 100 beans? Hi. Hi, Trojan Peace. How are you doing? How are you doing? Also, <laughs> Bertopian did Streamlabs mute you or something. I'm sorry. I have no control. How much money do I have? Okay, I can spare a honey beans. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're welcome. I won't let you down. But I want to play at the arcade. Oh, there's a cute mushroom girl over there. I want to look at her. Come on, Rusty. Hello, you look cute. Hello, mushroom witch. Witch mushroom. Oh my gosh, hello. I'm so excited to see a new person in town. I heard you were opening up the cafe again, and I'm so excited. Please save something sweet for me. Mushroom! Oh gosh, hi! You need anything? More chairs! You look just like your avatar here. Yeah, I've been trying to swag myself out to look like it. Well, variety never hurts, and it can be hard to find your favorite seat in a cafe. What's comfy for one person is bad for another. Ah! Blasphemy! How could you say that? What's comfy for one person is comfy for all person. Huh? No, I guess she's right. I don't know. So how about it? Could you maybe make sure you've got at least three different kinds of chairs in your cafe? Who are you? The CEO of chairs? I don't want to... Sure. I want to make sure everyone feels comfortable. Fit with cat ears because this is a cat game. Yeah. I wonder if I can... I kind of want to swag out my girl a bit, but I completely forget how to... Well, I can do that. Hey, bipedal cat, do you want to play? Hey, do you like this? Huh? He's too humanized for my foolish tricks and toys. Let's see. Furniture, toys. Townsfolk, quests. That's the map. Here we go. Yeah, um. I look pretty cute. Don't look as cute as I could. Oh, wait, no. Myself a big butt? I don't really have that big of a butt. <laughs> the CEO of chairs. Okay, okay. Let's take a look. I want to add some more clothes to myself. Socks. Got the right socks now. And I gotta give them the stripe. That is not striped. That is a checker. That's not what I wanted. Huh? 
The cat socks are pretty dope, but I ain't gonna lie to that. Well, I thought I would get stripes. Hiya! I wanted stripes. Huh? Well, that's kind of lame. Any stripe, huh? Star, mushroom, bows. That's ridiculous. It's checkerboard. It should be a stripe. That's ridiculous. Oh well. Okay. Well, I guess I don't want a design. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. What? Ah! Oh! Ah! Uh! Huh? Oh! Wait a second, I, I maybe can make this work and make it not look too stupid. Good enough! So is this game PC's Animal Crossing? Yeah, very much, um... Very much, how should I say... Um... In the game Animal Crossing. Spin them out. Woo! -hoo! That's cool. What? Well, okay, I didn't like that. Okay. Very customizable. Well, I'm still gonna kind of have checkerboard socks, but let's see. My socks are like that, kind of. Okay. And did I buy some new shoes? I did. No! I don't have the right shoes. Crap, so I'll just wear my slippers for now. And all I got is this going on. Oh! But I can add cat ears now. Yay! That's what I want. This is what I want. Very good. Very good. Okay. Now we're very, very matching. I love that. I love it. Okay. So let's see. Okay, I need to talk to Kiva. And add some of that. And put some flowers in the cafe. Okay, great. I wonder if I can, like I said before, I wonder if I can make the cafe a little bit bigger, though. Who jumped in the water? Rusty! Rusty, get out of there, buddy. Egg. Uh, who turned off the lights? Do we not have lighting here? Also, I put a rand panda in the cafe, and the owl is in the table. Everyone's going up to bed. I'm going to place some furniture then. Okay. Basic. Ooh, a basic cat tree. Yes. Man, we are running out of room in here, homies. Cute. What is this? The dance potion. Cool. Rad. Spooky and egg. I guess egg is what we gotta do, huh? But I have so many egg table. There's no point. I'll just put the I'll put the cat tree over here for the kitty boys. There we go. And we'll make it nice. Good. Yay! Wait. Okay. Okay. That's good. That's good. Sometimes I get confused about this game. Good. Wait, no. Now I made it ugly. Okay. F. Now we go back here. You know, I ain't gonna lie to you. 
may or may not be a little bit broken. There we go. Hi, welcome back, Wack. Comfy drip check. <laughs> I'm wearing uh, my classic sweater, my shorts, my running shoes, my hot pants, and ears and ribbons. Hi, Deadman6220, how are you doing? I'm gonna try that again. Let's add a rad dresser right over here. Uh, how do I rotate it? E. Perfect. Put the rad dresser right there. And, ooh, the rad bed. What? Oh, and I'll put the rad bed over here. And now you guys can come have a, oh, or not. You guys can come have a sleepover if you want. Because now I have two beds. But I should probably go to bed. So I can, um. So it can be the daytime. I like how she becomes jumping furniture in order to place it. <laughs> Rad bed for the radiation bed. It's like fallout. Wouldn't the rad bed technically be a, a like a tanning bed because you get radiation that way? Okay. Okay, let's go find Kiva. So that's four. Um, Kiva, that's the mayor, Kiva, right there. I gotta go see her. Rusty, come. Let's go. Wow, even the world looks cute. It is very cute, isn't it? And cheaper than Animal Crossing, too. Almost definitely. It's the controls are a little goofy. But it is really fun to play and very relaxing. Oh, I see a purple bunny. Look a purple bunny. The Easter bunny. It's the Easter Bunny. I'm going to catch him. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. I got you. I got you. <laughs> I got him. I'm holding him interestingly. Go to the cafe. And Kiva's over this way. I think I see her, actually. Is this Elden Ring? <laughs> Another Easter Bunny! And Kiva just disappeared. Oh no, she's just clipping through her house. That's okay. Hey, Kiva, hey. Stop no clipping into the back rooms of Cal- No! Come here! Hey, friendo, how are you doing today? I'm doing great. Thank you for asking. I did the thing. I was in the cafe earlier and I saw patches there. The red panda, okay. I was so happy. Yay! $300! Yay! The magical mixer. Okay. Oh! Ah! One food of each type. Yay, we get to do some cooking. One sweet, one savory, and one fancy food sometime this week. I'll bring a whole spread. Welcome! PK, welcome back, Ness. Right now, we're just doing little quests for the people. 
the people in this nice town. Pink Bunny. But now that I got $300, I think it's appropriate that I go blow it on a recipe or something. Ah, uh, I want to play Harvest Moon. Thinking about all this. I, you know, I really did like Harvest Moon. It's a game that I grew up with. I also really like Stardew Valley. $800 for a croissant? You better be kidding me. You better be kidding me. That's a cute cat bed. These are really cute, but I don't really want to buy them. Okay, drip time. Whoa, a red panda tail. A deer tail. A sailor hat. A bunny tail. That would be cute. I love bunny tails. Wolf ears. Ah. Oh. I'll buy the wolf ears. But I want more recipes. I guess all I really have is the croissant recipe. Unless I talk to that weird cat by the garbage can, maybe he'll maybe he'll have a garbage can recipe to give to me. Hello. Da hello dumpster cat. What's for sale? Okay. Okay. Roll for cat. Should we make bread? Should we make bread? Or should we make muffins? The bread looks really cute. I think I should make the bread. Ew, look at that. That's gross. I think I'll make the bread. Bread? Okay. Kaching. It's time for bread. Okay. We've got everything we need. And I've got you and you've got me. Sweet, savory, and fancy. Six fresh cupcakes. Oh, my... My cookies are stale. Bread. Oh, it's a song that plays occasionally. Oh, cheesecake. Well, guys, shall we make cheesecake? <laughs> I think I'll make bread first. Oh, giant raccoon! Wow, a Raichan. So cute. Huh? Oh my goodness, everything's up here. Okay, up we go. I need one yeast. Oh, I need everything. I need everything, so I will just... I will just push it off the thing here. Okay, that didn't go as expected. No! <laughs> Miniature Comfy dives to her death. Okay. Got the flower. Yay! Now back up in the elevator. What happened to you? I became... I became tiny. Can I pour the sugar and and hit it? Probably not. Oh well. Ah! Scary. 
As much as being a miniature while you're cooking is like the cutest thing ever, wouldn't it be so frustrating? Fun sized comfy? I'm already fun sized. <laughs> I'm already fun sized. Oil. No, we cannot use vegetable oil to make bread. Not good for you. Whatever, I guess I'm not eating it. And now salt. What happened to the heist? I'm not sure if enough people joined. It would be hard to cook when you're that small, also a lot more dangerous. Yeah, you might just fall into the pan and, and become what you're making. I made Rice Krispies last night. Rice Krispie squares. Has anyone had Rice Krispie squares here? So I have a secret little trick for you guys if you make Rice Krispie squares. You know how you have to melt the marshmallows in the pan and stuff? While you're melting the marshmallows, Add some vanilla and add some cinnamon. It really makes all the difference. Because if you have just that, it's gonna be it's gonna be just like marshmallow flavor, which is just plain sugar and like corn syrup and stuff, right? So there's really not a lot. However, oh with the vanilla and the cinnamon, that's so so good. Mix. Mix. Okay, it's time to mix it. Here we go. Almost. Almost. I think that was pretty perfect if I do say so myself. Great. Good. Almost. Great. Look at him go around. Oh! Look, it's my sous chef scritches here to knead the dough. <laughs> I gotta find the good spot. Where's the good spot? Oh, it's over that way. Okay, hold on. There we go. Are you kneading? Right on the bomb. Yay! <laughs> kneading the dough. Uh-oh. Comfy, get out of there. You don't want to go there. Okay, this way. <laughs> now I'm scratching again. Wow! Thank you so much, friend. Thank you so much for the Hotline Miami Steam Key. Thank you. Oh, I can't wait to play that. Oh, wow! Thank you. Thank you for the Blasphemous Steam Key. Oh my god, I'm excited to play both of those. Wow! There's a lot of Certified Hood Classics happening right now. Thank you so much, friend. Wow. This is a Certified Hood Classic. Wow, there's a lot of Certified Hood Classics. Thank you so much. <laughs> Hi, Nathan. Thank you so much, friend. Oh my god, I'm getting spoiled right now. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. Thank you so much. Yay. Chocolate and socks and games. My favorite. Thank you so much, Anonymous, for your kind donations. Thank you, Nathan. 
I'm also insanely excited for those games. I just found out about the game uh, Blasphemous today because I was uh, making a video that required the song Little Dark Age in it, and someone had a had a video about it, and I was like, oh my god, this looks awesome. So I really enjoyed it. Also, thank you, Credo, and hello, friend. Thank you, Credo. Thank you, Nathan. Thank you so much, guys. Wow. No! Whoa! Did you guys notice that? I fell off the counter and there was a whole group of cats with a trampoline there ready to save me. Wow, fascinating. But thank you so much for all the certified hood classics, friend. It's so, it's so great to be surrounded constantly by certified hood classics. And now we have created our bread. Amazing. Long time no see. How have you been? I've been great. Thank you for asking. Thank you so much for asking. Yay, we made bread. It's time to put the bread in the display case. Oh, it's already in there. Wow. Wow, they look great. My cookies are stale, though. Kitty. Well, I guess we better make the cheesecake, too. Comfy hype. <laughs> I'm extremely hyped right now. I don't know when I should tell you guys my big my big news if I should tell you it sooner or later. Maybe I will tell you soon. Hi, it's me. How are you doing? It is a cute cafe, isn't it? Let's get this bread! Let's get this cheesecake. I haven't made cheesecake in a while. The last time I did, it was one of those like kind of um, like mixes that you use for it. So it wasn't actually like a real cheesecake. It was more like a gelatin cheesecake kind of deal. So it wasn't the greatest, but I still enjoyed it. I think my favorite kind of cheesecake is um, either Japanese cheesecake or just typical like New York cheesecake with cherries on it. Yummy. Waiting warmly for the announcement. Ah, thank you, goodness me. Today I beat wind, wind water for the first time. You mean you mean Wind Waker, like Legend of Zelda Wind Waker? That, friend, is my favorite Zelda game, and in my opinion, the most underrated Zelda game. Actually, you know what? I can't tell if it's the most underrated Zelda game or if Twilight Princess is the most underrated Zelda game. I like any fresh, fruity cheesecake. Yeah. Have any of you guys ever been to the Cheesecake Factory? I've never been to the Cheesecake Factory, and I really want to go. New York with strawberries is the best, in my opinion. See, I am a strawberry girl. I ate strawberries for breakfast this morning. But, um... I don't know. I feel like I... Oh my god, they even saved the flower. Legends. I forgot what I was talking about. Legend of Zelda. Right. I can tell you what the most overrated Legend of Zelda game is. I can tell you that. And it's not even Ocarina of Time. Ho! Oh. Early stream today. I'll see you after my commute, Comfy Chan. Okay, Lagar. Enjoy your commute. I hope it's good to you. Wow. That cheesecake just got launched out of there. Fascinating. Okay. So now we need to make the filling. So we need cream cheese and sugar. I got the sugar here. 
You think Ocarina of Time is the second one? For overrated or underrated? Ocarina of Time is the second most overrated, but it's still a great game. The first most overrated Zelda game. Handy P. Handy P. You know this. It's Breath of the Wild, guys. It's not even that great. Please don't, please don't hate on a gamer for saying that, but it's it's true. Crave cheese. Yummy. Remember then that point of life where like whipped cream cheese was a big thing? And like everyone wanted it. And by everyone, I mean me because I was like eight. And I was very easily susceptible to commercials. It's really not that great. I'm still procrastinating my homework. Awa! Do your homework. I command thee to do thy homework. Do you need help with your homework? <laughs> I'll help you. Okay, we need egg. <laughs> oh, don't be sad, Awa. You'll be happy that you that you did it. You can tell your teacher this interesting creature on the internet told you to do it. And it goes. Boing. Boing. So, yeah, as far as my opinion on Breath of the Wild is, um... It just, like, if I want to play a game that's like that... Like that kind of, like, very open world, massive map, not very linear kind of game... You know what I'm gonna play? I'm gonna play Skyrim, okay? I'm gonna play Skyrim. And I'm waiting for a special time in my life to play Skyrim. Because I know I'm going to lose everything in my life as soon as I play Skyrim. Like, it's... Everything's gonna be put on hold for Skyrim. So I, I need a good point in my life when I don't have a lot going on that I can play Skyrim. Yeah, like I was saying, I, I 100% would rather play something like Skyrim than have that in a Zelda format. The reason I am so very, very strongly opinionated about uh, Wind Waker and Twilight Princess being the best Zelda games is the fact that they're both very plot driven. Very plot driven. Uh, they have elements of darkness. There's not a lot of like loopholes or anything. I think I might go now. It's been a long day. I got all Triforce shards and beat Ganondorf in one day. So have an amazing day. Sorry, I was just not safe for long. That's fantastic, friend. Good for you. Finding the Triforce shards was annoying. Comfy Twan, I recommend Enderall. It's free Skyrim total conversion with better story and characters. Well, to be quite honest, I play Skyrim. Well, I ha no, I don't play Skyrim, but I will play Skyrim solely because it's a Bethesda game. And I love them, all their glitches and, and crap and all, you know? Everyone knows how much I love Fallout New Vegas. Been playing the game for like 10 years. Maybe longer. We made the filling, everyone! Yay! Pour the batter into the crust. Okay. There's a bit of flour in there, too. Don't mind that. There we go. Now we can put it in the ov. <laughs> Yay! And back I go into my hamster wheel. Okay, Trojan. I'll listen to you. I trust you. I trust you. I'm burning it! Make it end! I burnt it! 
Oh well, burnt cheesecake it is. Ha 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 ha. Oh, chocolate. Comfy makes a cute hamster. Hamphy. <laughs> I would be the kind of hamster to eat another hamster in the cage. It's just the truth. Woo! The icing pogo stick. <laughs> you know, I don't know how I feel about chocolate on top of cheesecake. It's like, I don't like the idea of chocolate on a, um... On, I have to throw it? Oh my lord, I have to go all the way back here. Um, I don't like the idea of chocolate on a Rice Krispie Square. Yay! It's not bad, actually. You think so? This looks awfully cute. I ain't gonna lie, it looks very cute. Okay, so we've made the recipes. Let's take a look at the quests. The anniversary date is tonight. Piece of flower furniture. I thought I had flower furniture. Okay, well, I made all of those. The flowers look great in the cafe. I do not remember putting flowers in the cafe. Oh, I did. I did. Okay, I gotta go find Blossom then. Oh, well. I turned on my space heater behind me and now my back is burning up. Hold on. I was cold, now I'm not. My friend bakes and she made me try chocolate cheesecake and I loved it, but then again, everyone has their preferences. I think my favorite kind of cookies are chocolate cookies. Or like, or like, why are there so many colorful bunnies around? Every time I come back, there's more. They're multiplying. You're Blossom, aren't you? Good morning, Starshine. This game is too comfy. I don't trust it. <laughs> Why don't you trust it? Thank you. Okay, so, so many. Because you were there, you sold us the sweets. But it's strange. almost feels like it was just the two of us in our own little world. Gosh, Blossom is so cute, isn't she? Yeah, she is. Please take this. Thank you. There's so many bunnies. I, well, it's a little overwhelming, but I'll just say I love it here. Tea parties with sweets. A tea party sounds amazing. Comfy is going to put other people in a cake and eat them. Hmm. People cake. Hi, Comfy. I'm here for good now. I have a fortune cookie. Do you want to hear the fortune? Yes. I do want to hear the fortune. Please tell me. Ooh, roll cakey. I want to make roll cake. It's actually pretty hard. It doesn't seem like it would be, but it is. Well, now I have a quest to make a roll cake. Hey, who are you? I would like to hear the fortune, Haro. Please tell me. 
Hey there, flower friend. Ooh, what's for sale? Citrus. Ah! Meow! I can add to my garden. Wow! Okay, well, that's great. I think I'll buy... I'm gonna buy a bush. <laughs> Maybe I'll buy a fence. I think I will buy a couple fences. And I'll buy a bush. Oh crap, I'm broke now. Spent all my money on bush and now I'm broke. Just another Saturday for me. Alright, let's go build a garden. Ahem. <clears throat> They do have nice greetings. How to Pelagic Rainbow's Fortune says, Commitment is the daily triumph of integrity over skepticism. That's a great saying, actually, to tell the truth. Because, yeah, you could be very skeptical that something won't work out, and then if you commit to it and you make it happen... And it does work out. Integrity and faithfulness. That's a Star Ocean game. Let's add to our garden. <laughs> Cute. Can I not? Garden. Ah! Haha! <laughs> I'm a bush! Look at me! Aw, he's sleeping where I wanted to put it. That's okay. I think I'll put a little fence near the, uh, the pond. And we can have a little garden moment. Actually, maybe I'll put it out front. I think that would be very cute. I've always wanted a white picket fence. Mr. Raccoon, you're in the way. <laughs> you're in the way. We'll have a little side garden right here. Ah! My bad. There's a cat lady in there. It seems. I hope she's enjoying the cafe. I do need to take a look at my stale cookies, though. Can I get them to leave? I don't know. Oh well. <laughs> ghillie suit comfy. Sniper comfy in a pink ghillie suit. No one will ever see me. Hmm, roll cake. Roll cake. I think I'll make a roll cake. One strawberry? I feel like I need more than one. I don't know, it's your life though. Kitten or kitten? A kitten. Evie, Evie, why? Hi. What kind of cat would you be if you were a cat? Do tell. 
Also, hello, Andres Joel. How are you doing, friend? Says so hello, comfy in chat. Hello, how are you doing? If you were a cat, Andres, what kind of cat would you be? I said I'd be a Himalayan or a Persian cat. But I also might be the kind of cat that you find one day sitting in your car. And you don't know what to do with it, so you just adopt it. The randomized cat distribution system of life. And one day you'll get comfy, the cat. Cats rule the world. Oh, hi, by the way. Hi, Shadow. How are you doing, friend? Glad to see you here. You're so correct about that. Cats do rule the world. Yeah, I hear you, kitty. What's wrong? Whoa, Rusty, chill, bro. What's going on out there? Milk? I can see galaxies within my cauldron. Doing good. Hope you're doing well. Thank you. Also, I'm not a cat person. I've got a bit of allergies, so no clue. Huh. Couple allergies, huh? I'm allergic to cats too, so I get it. But I, I just love them. That's okay, Andres. I will assign you with, um. A uh, Scottish Fold Cat. OMG, there's a cat in my neighborhood that runs under cars as soon as it enters the driveway. Tries to get scratchies from anyone who leaves their car. Oh, I hope that cat is careful. I don't like when cats go around cars. I get so scared that someone may hurt them. My cat's an outdoor kitty, but he's really afraid of cars and like loud sounds in general, so I don't really have to worry about him too much. And the last ingredient, oil. Yay. Look at, guys, look up in the corner uh, above Sunday. It has the cutest cinnamon roll I've ever seen, ever. Isn't that adorable? It's got a little face on it. Got a cute little face. Like this. It is mixing time. Well, I'm glad that you do that, Hado. Yeah, I feel the same way, Lord Juicy. Almost. Amazing! Yay! Oh, the batter. Okay. Oh, yes. Just like we're actually making a roll cake, we have to uh, put it out in a big square sheet. A little bit of flour in there, as usual. And we're gonna put it in the oven now. Comfy hamster time. This thing seems virtually impossible to get like a good, perfect cook on this game. Yay. Now, what do I have to do? Cover the cake with icing completely. Oh, it's just leaking everywhere. Huh? Damn, I'm getting my feet all over it too. Gross. Comfy feet cake. The 
This is very difficult. It's okay. You know what? I'm, do <laughs> I'm doing something. Doing something. It says I have a lot of coverage. I really don't think I do. That's not really completely done, but you know what? We ball. We keep moving. Roll up. Okay, I roll up. Hop out at the after party. You and all your friends and what? Whoa! Oh my goodness, look. That's great. Thank you. Does Comfy become a tiny action figure whenever she cooks? You guys have seen me cook before. And yeah, what if I secretly was a tiny action figure the whole time? No, please let me get it. There we go. And the final roll. Cute. And I guess I have to put a little bit of icing on it, huh? Thank you, Lord Jesus. See. Okay. You know, I wish instead of like points, it gave me money. Ride the balloon. There's a balloon, huh? A balloon! Tiny Comfy piloting a Mecha Comfy. <laughs> Imagine. You know, I was thinking today... I was on TikTok and I saw somebody who had this like... Um, you know how you can build Gundam gunpla kits? Well, somebody had one for like Metal Gear... I think it was Metal Gear R or something. And it was literally one of the coolest things I've ever seen. And I want it. I want to become a we weapon to destroy Metal Gear. Oh, I only got one. Crap. One, two, three. One, two. Oh. Oh, we didn't get a second chance. Vivian Fan! Oh my goodness! Vivian... No... <laughs> uh, it's funny because I actually... Um, downloaded a jar... Asset... Like a jar, like a, a jar... It's, ho it's horrible. I'm not bringing it out here. When the occasion calls for it, the jar will happen. It is sus! Okay, let's take a look. How do I switch up my thing, huh? I forget how to do my display case. Oh well, I made a bunch of different foods for everyone, so this is gonna be great. Now I can go back to Mayor Kiva. Oh, you good? You good, raccoon bro? You know what, I'm just gonna walk away from that situation. Just opened another fortune cookie and literally the fortune was enjoy the meal, buy one to go to. <laughs> uh, funny marketing moment. I need to have a drink of water. Hydration check for everyone. Water. He wishes.
Okay, Mayo Kiva. Oh, look at she got a bunny. A bunny. And a chicken. I did the thing. <gasps> flan? I've always wanted to make flan and try it out. Wow, and a thousand dollar reduce. Hooray! I want to go down to the lighthouse. I want to go there. I want to go there. Whoa, who are you? I want to go there. I'm gonna go see if I can go there. This game is a fever dream of cats ragdolling when you pick them up. <laughs> it is. I'm gonna go down there and see if there's uh, something I can do. I remember at one point I saw a big cat stuck in a log. Maybe I can go there. Aw, Hado. I have a picture of me from like a few years back on my fridge. And it has like a little pocket in it. And every time I eat Chinese food, I put one of the fortunes in there. <gasps> There's a kitty stuck in a log! A kitty stuck in a log. Kitty. Oh no, I need to help you out. Well, I guess I gotta get off kitty. Hold on. Huh? Kitty. Can I not... Use it? Rusty, I don't know. Oh, I'm sorry, Rusty. I did not mean to do that to you. Rusty, I don't know what's going on here. I can't seem to get this cat up. Hello, kitty. That's the biggest big cat I've ever seen. Ah, uh, look, guys, look. <laughs> Look at the toe beans! Look at the toe bean! One of the cutest toe bean you've ever seen! What a cute, what a cute toe bean! In the lig! <laughs> In the log! Logma! Like ligma, but log! Oh, I'm Naruto running! Hey, I see someone interesting over there. I'm Naruto running over to them. No! Now I'm swimming and you can see my butt. Oh no. Whoa. Hello. Hello, Mistress Cat Lady. Hello. Talk to me, friend. Uh, maybe. If you're going soon, could you do something for me? I make the herbal potions that Lumi uses at the onsen, and she placed an order right before the landslide happened. If you take it up there for me, I can give you some sort of payment. Okay. Uh-oh. Trouble in paradise? Well, well, that makes sense. Huh. I'll try fixing her. Come on, Rusty. Up the mountain we go, friend. Wow, I got onto Rusty in a very interesting fashion just now. 8.15 Yeah, I don't know when the heist... When the first heist happened, I'm not sure 
the first great comfy heist. Wow, the snowy mountain and the deer. I really want a reindeer. I find reindeer to be so majestic. Ah, oh, I see. Wow, I do like the snowy mountain. It's quite quiet. Poly bears and the babies. So cute. Let us go all the way to the top of the mountain. The view is great. Miles and miles of absolutely nothing. That was one thing that I loved about Wind Waker. When you looked out onto the sea, they made the opportunity to, you know, make little shadows and stuff so you'd think oh, what's that island i have to go check it out and then like changing the wind patterns and stuff i just loved it i always think of the coca-cola commercials whenever i see polar bears yeah they really did monetize polar bears didn't they them smart people what is that what's that what is that? What is that? Is that a tiny fat cat? Oh, it's a snowball. It's a tiny fat cat snowball or something. Uh -huh, it's getting bigger. <laughs> Uh, I want to try and make it really big. Hold on. Eh. I feel like I'm going to kick it off the side, though. Look at it. He is very... R he is very round and rotund. Coca-Cola made me believe the polar bears were cute and friendly. But they are cute and friendly. Have you ever... Have you ever tried petting one? I'm sure they're super cute and super friendly. Damn, look at the look at the snowball. It's so goofy looking. Maybe if I roll him big enough, he'll become a real cat. And then I can post him to R slash heckin' chonkers for everyone to look at. I'm gonna roll him down the hill. Goodbye. I don't want to play with you anymore. And just like that, he was gone forever. I think I saw a bunny stuck in the wall over here. Yeah, hey dude, you don't look so good. Let me help you out. Harvey. Whoa, oh my god, look at him. Oh, Harvey. Harvey, go to the cafe. Oh my god, Harvey, I killed you. Okay, no, you're good now. Whoa. Long live the king. <laughs> Man, I was so obsessed with the Lion King when I was a little kid. Here we are, at the onsen. Where's the lady? I guess because it's nighttime, she may not be here. Oh no, there she is. Hello. Hello, I hope you are doing well today. Thank you. I want to talk to you about something. Thank you so much. 
I haven't seen her in ages because of the landslide. Ha. Huh. Well, you know what they say. Time makes you bolder. Even children get older. And I'm getting older, too. Isn't that what they say about landslides? <laughs> and I had a great new idea for a magical swimsuit that she would keep her dry while she soaks. She doesn't like to get wet anymore now that she's part cat. That makes sense for a cat. She used to love the onsen. I know I can find a way to help her enjoy it again. Hello, the epic guy 69. How are you doing, friend? Wow. Thank you, Trojan. Fun fact about the Lion King. Scar's real name translates to trash. Don't remember how his real name is spelled. Aw. Anyway, here's the payment for Autumn. Can you bring it back to her? Okay, I'll do a favor for you, too. Ah, the magic of the snowy mountains. There's so much to love about the mountains. There's beautiful views, and the trees, and the fluffy snow, but the best part is all the special animals that live up here. My favorite is the Arctic fox. It's so majestic. My favorite snowy animal is probably... A bobcat. Bobcats are so cute. And my cat kind of looks like one. I thought if you had a snow animal in your cafe, it would be a great way for the townsfolk who aren't able to make the trek up here get to know the mountains too. It might even encourage some people to come up here. You got it. Okay, so the arctic fox, I'm supposed to go to the cafe. I swear I saw her up on up here a minute ago. Rusty, chill, dude. Rusty, everything's gonna be fine. Ah, oh, I guess. I guess arctic fox. Oh, hey, there you are. Come here. Come here. Come here. Yukiko. Cute name, snow child. I got her. I got her. I got you, Yukiko. You're mine now. La 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 la. Okay. I wish I was part cat too. I am today, but it would be fun to be part cat all the time and have cute Neko Mimi all the time. Go to the cafe. No! The cafe is full. Does that mean I have to kick someone out? Hi, Irk, please. Good evening, friend. How are you doing? Thanks for stopping by. Glad to see you here. Rusty, we must go back to the cafe and kick someone out. It's time to make an animal at the cafe homeless. Are you coming along, Yukiko? Yep, she is. Doing good. Glad I could finally catch this game. Oh, I'm happy you're here, friend. We did start a little earlier than usual, but that's because I have an important call to make later on at uh, 10, so I need to be ready for that. The poly bears. I wonder if they would like a cold glass bottle of Coca-Cola. We get to vote someone off the island. Yes. Yes, we do. Who's going to be made homeless on today's episode of Calico? It's okay. In this game, none of the animals tried to kill me. Which is, um, 
a lot different from like 99% of the other games that I play. Okay, who's getting kicked off the island? I would never make my boy Rusty leave. I love my boy Rusty. Also, I don't know where Yukiko went. Did she just peace? Okay, um... Where's the crow? He's being annoying. I'm kicking him out. Okay, Mr. Edgar Allan Poe. Be free. Get out of here, dude. Now I need to find Yukiko. Did I lose her? I thought I told her to follow me. You're not Yukiko. Let's go look for Yukiko. Maybe she's still up on the mountain. Doggy. Ah, it's raining. Mame. Mame does. Edgar has been eliminated with one single vote. <laughs> ah, Yukiko, there you are. You tiny dog. Well, I guess you're a fox, so you're kind of a mix of a dog and a cat, hey? Yukiko. Woo. It's time for you to go to the cafe. You're now mine. Yay. Edgar can come stay with me. I wish I could train... I, I want to train foxes to... Not foxes. I want to train crows to steal money for me. That would be pretty cool, I think. Mm, people are sleeping. When will you play Omori again? Good question, friend. I was going to play it this week, but I swapped it out for this game. But soon, don't worry. It's on the rotating roster of games, so... It'll be soon. Probably in a week or two. Okay, let's see what quests. Okay, oh cool. Whoa! I didn't know I could give them cowboy hats. Yo! <laughs> yes! This is everything I've ever wanted in life. <laughs> I love it so much. Uh, hi, F. How are you doing? Well, everyone, you know what? Now that I'm sitting here thinking, um... I feel like I want to tell you my big announcement. I feel like it's a good time to do that. Old Rusty the Trusty. That's right. Old Trusty Rusty. We love him. I gotta go find the Witch Lady. While I go find the Witch Lady, I will tell you my big announcement. So... What day is it today? It's the 1st of March. In exactly seven days, I... And picking up and moving across the world. Um, yeah, I'm moving to a completely different country. 
It is a country I have lived in before though. <laughs> and I hope that I can still manage to bring you guys content. The big thing is, is the country that I'm moving to is, um, has a 13 hour time difference. So streams, when I am able to stream, are most likely going to be in the morning for me. I'll try and make them as um, accommodating to, I guess, the EST time. Yes. Um, and I would also like to maybe post some some content there, like a little like vlogging content almost. Uh, because I feel like it would be a place a lot of you would really, really want to explore. Hi, Mystery Gresh. So yeah, I, I really want to do some like unboxing hauls and stuff once I get there. And maybe even take you guys on tours if I possibly can. But, I'm also starting a full-time job over there. That's mainly the reason why I'm moving. So, my time is going to be a little bit less than I am used to. Um, but still, this is a huge passion for me. And it's my the best hobby I have. So, I'm obviously going to be trying my best to keep putting out as much energy as I can into this uh, into this whole streaming thing as well because I love you guys a lot and uh, it really does keep me um, I guess feeling good because I'm gonna be very alone over there I'm away from all of my family and friends basically so um, I would love to still hang out with you guys as much as I could so the big thing is, um, this is the main thing. My work doesn't start until April. And I arrive on the 8th. So up until then, I'm going to have a decent amount of time to do a little bit of streaming. So uh, in March, I'm going to be trying to stream as much as I can to hang out with you guys as much as I can and obviously give you maybe some some like POV and room tour and stuff like that <laughs> even the crow in game walked up to you at that moment <laughs> yeah guys I'm very 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 excited uh, it, yeah it's a huge life development as I said to you guys um I'm probably going to, though, have a, a bit of a hiatus in between tomorrow and going and arriving and settling in. And why me can, why you hit the nail on the head. You are absolutely right. So it's just uh, very, very, very exciting. But yeah, guys, we... I'm I'm not going anywhere. Well, I f physically I am going. I am going places, but I will still be putting a a ton of work into uh streaming and talking to you guys. Whoa, what's going on here? What's going on here? Oh my lord. I'm stuck. Ah! 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 ah I'm scared. Stop. Yes. Ah! Okay, let me go. Let me go. Ah! Rusty, hold me. That was terrifying. <laughs> Thank you so much, everyone, for all the kind words. Thank you so much, Vivian. Coffee chan, mukbang, different kinds of wasabi. Do you want me to... Do you want me to die? <laughs> Actually, wasabi is really not that bad. Woo! Thank you so much, goodness me. It's 
So yeah, guys, big, big, big stuff. And honestly, yeah, good luck is the best thing that I need right now. Oh my god, there's so much to do when you go over there. This is my second time around doing it, so I'm not as scared, I guess, as I was the first time. It still feels really surreal. I haven't even finished my packing yet. Thank you so much, Coyote Knight. Thank you. I think the thing I'm worried about the most is having a good Wi-Fi connection when I do want to stream for you guys. Okay, we, we should probably go back up the mountain, huh? Yeah, Trojan, like, um... Like six years ago. I only really know a little bit. And my job doesn't require it, how to pelagic rainbow, so I don't really have to. But uh, I'm going, to, I'm going to obviously to, uh, I guess fit in. I mean, when you're a guest in someone's country, you should try and fit in, you know. But everything's in English anyway. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, everyone. Don't worry, I'm not... I mean, I'm not gonna be going anywhere. You guys mean so much to me. I could never just drop this on its head. Don't worry, there's subtitles there. Coffee <laughs> 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 uh, chan when she moves to Japan and there's not subtitles. Honestly, friends, it's a great, it's a really, really awesome place to visit. Highly recommend. Okay. Let's go talk to this onsen lady. Ah! I'm stuck under the thing. What are we playing tomorrow? We're playing Undertale tomorrow. Yeah, we're playing Undertale tomorrow. God, I feel like I'm so close to beating Undertale as well. Real life subtitles would help so much. Yeah, dude, like... Even just in general situations, I, I tend to not hear people a lot. Hello. Thank you, I hope you're doing well today too. I added her to the cafe, what are you talking about? I added her to the cafe. No! Whoa, Rusty's going buck wild. Rusty going crazy right now. Rusty, whoa. Rusty. Rusty, chill. You're crazy. Rusty's got the zoomies. <laughs> My cat had the zoomies the other day. He's really old. Yeah, that's one thing I'm also really scared about is leaving my kitty cat behind because he's old, but he's a very good boy. I'm sure he'll be great for me. I'm just going to miss his cuddles a lot. And I think he knows. He spends every night in my bed these days. I will go this way. Thank you for the head, Pat. Uh, it feels good. Thank you. Mushroom land. Oh, you must be the Arctic Fox. Okay, well, we have to go get rid of that other one then, I guess. Yeah, you really look like a fox. I guess the other one was just a doge. Hello. Hello. Sugar. Sugar the Arctic Fox. Cool. Okay, follow me, Sugar. Give Kitty scratches for us. Okay. I will. Kitty sometimes gives me scratches, too. Rusty, we cannot go to Mushroom Land. Rusty, we must go to Mushroom Land. Ooh, 
$150. Yay. Or beans. I want to go to Mushroom Land. Why does that look dog-like? The fox? Rusty, no! <laughs> it's okay, Rusty. We're all good now. Hopefully Sugar got the memo and is coming this way too. I want to buy more hats. Yeah, I want to buy more hats. Let's go down to the store and get more hats. <laughs> Fall damage. Man, Pokemon Violet looks different. Has anyone played it? The new Pokemon games, I mean? I was watching my friend Mallow play it the other night and she was trying to pick out a hairstyle and they didn't have any comfy type hairstyles. I was quite disappointed. Oh, there you are. Careful. Oh, she just snow clipped into the ground. I wonder if I'll get her back. Sugar. Oh, perfect. Okay, it's time to kick someone off. I love Violet. I played in Beat Violet. Pokemon Violent? <laughs> Funny. Uh, Pokemon Violent. Uh. Okay, I'm kicking you out. I'm kicking you out. There can only be one. I'm sorry, Marshmallow. I'm sorry, Marshmallow. It's time for you to go. Be free. Okay, sugar. <laughs> Rusty is so cute with his cowboy hat. Seems all the YouTubers are playing Scarlet, not Violet. So, is there a reason for that? Is there a reason for that? Are they more likely... Like, is it, is it better or something? Mallow played for two hours and found a shiny. <laughs> Mallow is a lucky girl. Pokemon mommy issues versus Pokemon daddy issues. Oh, fascinating. Okay, let's see if they've got any new swag for my boy. <laughs> the elephant hat. Overalls. Crop heart sleeve. That's kind of cute. Crop zip hoodie. Well, this is actually what I should have. And I'll get the elephant hat to put on someone. I think that would look so goofy. Goofy. I look goofy. I need a crop top. Huh, I guess I'll sure. This will be the comfy chan. You know what? I'll do this one too. Let's see. I spent all my money on clothes. What a classic comfy moment. Okay, my top. What do we think, guys? That looks pretty accurate, huh? Let's make the color a little bit more. What if I made it like my exact skin color? Naked! Oh no, I'm naked! Now I'm really naked! <laughs> I'm just gonna do it like this. 
I'm Nikki. Can I make a design? <laughs> a sussy design? Whoa. Whoa. It looks like I'm Nike. This is very sus. I wish I could draw it, because then I would draw boobs. Bagel shirt! Eh. I don't want a design anymore. There we go. No, why did I get bageled again? Oh, why am I bagel? <laughs> I want bagel. No. I did it to myself. I did it to myself. Breakdancing cat shirt. That's kind of dope. Hold on, wait. I don't want a design. I just look like I have a disease. I ruined it. No design. There. Now I'm naked and I have... And I have tiny shorts. It's perfect. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> wow, I made her sexy! <laughs> wow. Well, I didn't think it was possible, but it is. Fascinating. Let's go to the furniture store. Rusty, careful. My, I have no money. Well, anyone else bricked up right now? <laughs> Sorry, I had to say it. <laughs> <sighs> Too funny, guys. Too funny. Kitty. Char. Okay. 849. Oh my goodness, I got like... Ten more minutes. Let's see if we can do another quest in that in the meantime. Can we get much cursed?er So cursed. Wow! 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 Okay, I guess I gotta go to Blossom. Come, Rusty. Let us go. Thank you, Mr. Igarash. Wow, I outdid myself. This might be even better than your aunt's. Wait, don't tell her I said that, okay? Ooh, I got a flower crown. Yes, and a peachy design. Cute. Well, I know I absolutely have to give a flower crown to someone now. Who should I give a flower crown to? I will give it to the Trash King. Actually, I will give the elephant hat to the Trash King. I will give Hoots the flower crown. Or should I just make them all wear cowboy hats? If that's possible. Can you also wear the cowboy hat? Oh my god, they can all wear cowboy hats. Everyone's getting one. You can have a flower crown. You can have an elephant hat. Damn, I'm missing a couple of people still. Wow. 
Let's go take a look at everyone swagged out now. It's the Cowboy Cat Cafe. Cowboy Comfy Calico Cat Cafe with chat. Oh my god, look at everyone. Look at them. He's got the funny elephant hat on. He's... <laughs> look at this cowboy sleeping. Another cowboy. I love it. This is great. Take a look inside. <laughs> oh my god! Look at the cat! <laughs> and then the cutest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Everyone's a cowboy. It's like we're playing Red Dead Redemption, but not scary and sad. <laughs> this is great. Wow. All right, boys, let's go. I'm going to go back up the mountain and finish that one quest. You're eating the hat. <laughs> I don't know, Mr. Igresh. You could bet it all and potentially win. It's really, really hard to win with the gambling. Look how many coins Hattopelagic Rainbow has. Holy moly. Finally broke 400k. Oh my god. Look at the cat on my head. He's kind of like... He kind of wiggles. <laughs> he kind of wiggles every bump. Whoop. <laughs> Isn't that adorable? Hail Mary. You got this, Urk, please. Yeah, the cat's bum jiggles, too. Very cute. Aw, oh, kitty. You okay? Yeah, I know. Oh, well, you're already okay. Follow me. There you go. Mm, oh, Rusty, I feel like I should pet you too, buddy. You've been so good. Here, let me get out of clipping you. Oh, I, a big boy. It's a very big boy. <laughs> Get in. Me and my baby cats. Come here. Hey, I did the quest that you asked me to do. You gonna go chill in the hot tub? Five feet apart, because we're not gay. Hello. Hello, I hope you're doing well today. How is that mythical creature harmless to humans? <laughs> well, that's good, friend. I want a dog. All I've got is a pug, and I don't know that if that counts. <laughs> you have a pug? 
That's so cute, Hado. $300 redos. Wow. All right, Rusty. Rusty, uh, <laughs> everyone's just chilling in here. <laughs> oh! Oh! Ooh, yeah, get into it! Oh, what do you think about this? Whoa! Oh! I'm literally hitting the Gwitty at the onset! Oh my god! <laughs> oh, I'm hitting the Gwitty! Alright. Oh, Rusty came with me. And my other buddy. Comfy Twan is practically ready for onsen with that get up. What do you mean? This is a perfectly normal outfit. It's literally what I'm wearing right now. I mean, minus the fact that it's zipped open. I am basically wearing the exact same outfit. Socks and everything. <laughs> yes. Another comfort chan. Oh, look at the look at the yawning. Oh, and there's an owl beside my bed. <laughs> look, look at the look. <laughs> ah, sus. Sussy. Well, everyone. Time of night's rolling around. Thank you, everyone, for coming out tonight. I really appreciate playing games like this with you guys. Um, it's always a lot of fun. It's very comfy. It's very chilling. It's very cool. Can I have a dumb house? If I could buy you a dumb house, my friend, I would buy you a dumb house. But, you know, the economy. So everyone, um, like I was saying before, I mean, things are changing around here, right? And really, uh, there's gonna be so much going on. And I'll see you tomorrow night, and we're gonna play Undertale. I haven't played Undertale in a while, so I'm, <laughs> I'm excited for that. But, after that, I will be going on a undetermined hiatus until I'm moved and settled. Thank you everyone for coming tonight. And thanks for uh, letting me announce my big exciting news to you. I'm very, very excited for me, but I'm also like... I'm also like kind of nervous, I'm not gonna lie. a lot that's gonna happen and a lot that goes into it but everything will be okay Aww. Aww, Vivian Van. <laughs> wow thank you for that Vivian Van. thank you everyone for your fantastic vibes and your great um encouragement it really does fill me with determination 
<laughs> it means the most to me. And tomorrow, I'll see you for a great night of Undertale. You think we can beat it? Think we can beat it? We're in the, like, the scary lava fireplace. Maybe we can beat it. <laughs> I'm always happy when I have you guys with me. Huge shout out to everyone uh, who came in today and uh, the anonymous gifter who gifted me those wonderful items. Thank you so much. Everyone, stay safe, stay happy, and you know, most of all, stay comfy. I love you so much. Good night.